Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm talking about uh, the computer that I purchased the last time. Um, so this is going to be a review video. So this is the model uh, it was a UMX or sorry UM560 XT with 16 gigabytes of RAM and 512 uh, gigabytes of the hard drive space. So it's made by this company here, Minis Forum, I guess. Minis Forum. I'm not exactly sure. And uh, with this, it came with a AMD Ryzen 5, and uh, so that's basically what it is. Um, I kind of went through it through the last video, uh, so this was basically what it came with, if you guys can see that. So, I've been using this, and when I did the unboxing, I wasn't exactly too sure what the computer was capable of. So it does have Wi-Fi, it does have Bluetooth, um, everything works fine. Uh, when I did connect my original mouse, which is this mouse here, it uses a USB key type. Uh, the signal wasn't working very well. I'm not sure if that's because of the mouse or if that was because the computer can't uh, power up that key as, as strong as it's supposed to be. I'm not really too sure on that, um, but I switched to the Bluetooth mouse, which is now this mouse here, the Logitech, and everything works fine. Um, so the distance from the table that I'm putting this my keyboard and mouse on to that computer is less than three feet, I would say. So as you can see, the computer is there with the blue light on there. Um, and I'm quite impressed. Everything works very smoothly. Uh, I haven't had any issues. It doesn't overheat. I've been playing some games with it, not very much, but uh, everything seems to run more or less smooth. Um, I would not recommend this machine though to play high-end games. Uh, I've had lagging issues with uh, playing Tekken 7. It's kind of an older game, but I have had lagging issues with that. Um, the, the access speed of everything is very quick. Uh, this is the computer here. So this is, like I said, this is the website that I got it from and I paid $2.99 for this. I'm not exactly sure what they're charging now, but I got it while it was on sale. So if you're using this for like regular browsing, uh, you know, like word processing or something like that, then this is probably a good pick for you if you were using it to watch TVs, movies, uh, Netflix, something like that. This is definitely a good product for you. I haven't had any issues with that. Uh, the things that I didn't like out of the box was that, I mean, of course it didn't come with anything, but the stuff that it did come with, was, which was like the HDMI cable, it's so short. Uh, I need to order a new one because this setup right here that I have right now, that cable is just barely long enough to get it to the monitor. So the, the thing that they provided you is Quite useless unless you mount it directly to the back of your TV then that makes sense to have such a short cable the cable itself is probably about two feet or maybe three feet I'm not exactly too sure but it is very short and um, other than that though I haven't had any real issues I I'm not gonna open it up I'm not really a computer guy so you can't take my word as like the end all do all kind of thing so but for my purpose, I haven't had, any, like I said, I haven't had any issues, everything. I haven't had any blue screens or any kind of random shutdowns. Some people have been saying that about this brand. I haven't seen anything. I've been using it for, I don't know, maybe about two, three weeks now. Nothing of that sort. Of course, if it does happen within the year, I'll make an update video, tell you guys where the standing is and let you guys know exactly is this thing really uh, good or bad. But for right now, I'm... I'm saying that it's very good um, and for the price I would definitely say that this is a 10 out of 10 because if you were to buy a laptop I mean of course you know you don't get a monitor you don't get a keyboard you have to supply your own mouse but provided that most people have this kind of stuff already I mean it's not going to be that much more of an added expense um, but I did buy a new keyboard because I wanted a Bluetooth keyboard. Currently I'm using a uh, wired keyboard, very old one, still works perfectly fine. And then this mouse that I picked up from Office Depot, like I said, a Bluetooth one, paid about $15 for that. And the keyboard that I ordered, which I'll show you guys later in a review video, I paid another like $15 for that too. So, um, I mean, grand total is, about three, 
computer dirty or everything. I did buy that little thing sticking out of the, the computer. I'm not sure if you can see that. That is probably what not many people would use it or even need it. That's a USB-C to micro SD um, memory kind of memory card reader, I should say. So um, I haven't used the headphone jack. I haven't used the mic. Um, I haven't had a, a use for it yet, so I can't really review I give a review on that. Uh, headphones, Bluetooth headphones, I've used that perfectly fine. Um, all the other Bluetooth devices, perfectly fine. The distance is really good. I can walk around the house, although my house is not really huge or anything like that, but I can walk around, be in another room, still be able to listen to music, no big deal. So uh, all of that is great. And there isn't really any lagging issues on the internet. As you can see, the scrolling speed is quite quick and the access speed from one website to the next website. Of course, this is gonna be related to your internet speed, but once it loads, it's not like it's it's taking forever to load too, you know what I mean? So that right there is also very good. And I'm pretty satisfied with this company. I mean, there are a lot of companies out there that are making this kind of device now. Uh, it seems to be a new hit design for the computers. So uh, I can't really say if there's any difference between one company to the next because I was looking online there seems to be a lot of companies just basically making the same device just slapping their logo on it but for my purpose here I'm just going to talk about this company as I can like I said I can't review other people's company but this is definitely a go uh, I'm not sponsored by these guys I, I'm you know giving you guys my honest opinion I'm not sure about the other products like I said the other products do have negative reviews so be aware of what you're purchasing but if you guys are looking at the um 560 uh, i would definitely recommend you guys try it so like share subscribe i'll see you guys next time thanks